Uh, before I start, just wanted to slip in a trigger warning for suicide mention. This poem is a monthly guide to battling suicide. January. It's the new year. Maybe things don't change in the new year, but we could pretend they do with anything to keep us going. Keep going. Use this time to change whatever makes you unhappy. You can always do this. You have always been able to do this, stay alive. It's too early in the year to give up February. Love, as defined by the 14th, is bullshit. Your whole life is full of love, so why don't you love yourself, love yourself, before anyone else treat yourself well? You deserve it. Once you have loved yourself enough, love, a sister, a parent, a mentor, a stranger you never met, use your newfound capabilities strongly. Wisely, frequently, let love keep you living March. If the first part of the month feels bad, stick around until the first day of spring. At the arrival of the solstice, leave your unwillingness to live behind. You've survived another winter, so you know it can only get warmer, April. Don't mind the showers, please wait for the flowers. May, if May doesn't bring any flowers, just wait. They'll get here soon. In the meantime, watch someone graduate. Mm. Plan a vacation. Get ready for summer. June, you've made it halfway through the year. You might as well finish what you started. Stick around to see smiling faces inside swimming pools. Spend some time in the sun. I promise it'll make you feel better. Make the sun your best friend and spend all of your time together. July, watch the fireworks. Watch the gray gunpowder mixture of sulfur and charcoal reach for the sky. See it turn into something beautiful. Think of yourself, August. Come to realize it will always hurt that you were born with this hurt and that you did nothing to deserve this hurt. That it may never go away, September. World Suicide Prevention Day is September 10th. It is by now that you may realize that depression doesn't go away on its own, doesn't go away with pills, doesn't go away with therapy, doesn't go away with hospitalization, or hospitalization again. Depression is your permanent neighbor. But that doesn't mean that you can't smile. It doesn't mean that you cannot still be beautiful because anything you create, you say, you do, is yours. You are yours. You do not belong to this disease, so do not give your life away, October. You are not alone. You, like so many others, are affected by this disease that makes you feel alone. So use this month to notice how many others are just like you. November, understand that you will never run out of things to be thankful for. December, count the number of white lights on park trees. When you're done, think back to the past year. You have found reason in staying alive throughout the spring, the summer, the autumn. And once you've got your coat on, the winter isn't all that bad. If, you, if the year ends and you struggle to find reasons to live, start over. Thank you.